In a world where electric vehicles are swiftly becoming the norm, one car dares to redefine what we expect from sustainable driving. Let's unveil the all-new Kia EV2, a game-changer that's set to electrify the streets and shock the auto industry. The South Korean automaker Kia confirmed plans for the EV2, a 2025 release date for an entry-level small electric car at a media showcase event for EVs. With an emphasis on the European market, it will be positioned next to 14 other electric cars that Kia intends to sell by 2027. However, plans for landing in Australia have not yet been finalized. In a statement to the media, Kia stated that the EV2 and other electric models would be produced at the Slovakian plant starting in 2025. A European version of Australia's Kia Cerato small car is being produced in Slovakia in plug-in hybrid, diesel and gasoline configuration. But starting in 2025, the plant will only produce electric cars, such as the Kia EV2, EV3 compact SUV, and EV4 sedan. Although not many specifications have been revealed, the Kia EV2 is expected to have a European appearance and be smaller than the Kia EV3 SUV. What would that look like if you had a compact car that fits into your garage? What if we say that the Kia EV2 provides the opportunity to have two such cars in your garage? Yes, you heard that right. President and CEO of Kia Global said during a press briefing that the Kia EV2 is a really distinctive and very important model for the European market, and this is a smaller size than EV3. Along with three other electric vehicles, which include the production-ready EV5 SUV, the EV4 sedan concept, and the EV3 small SUV concept, the EV2's plans were revealed. These models, according to Kia, will be priced between $35,000 and $50,000. The automaker claims that the current EV6 and EV9 will eventually be available in an electric car range that starts at about $30,000 US dollars and goes up to $80,000. It allows for a starting price range of $30,000 to $35,000 for the Kia EV2. However, it is unknown how much it would cost in Australia. However, if it were to be constructed solely in Slovakia, the EV2 would be subject to a 5% import duty in contrast to Kia's vehicles from South Korea, with which Australia has a free trade agreement. The EV2 is anticipated to have a hatchback-like body type, but it might also take on SUV-like stylistic cues. Like the EV4 sedan concept, there is a space beneath the EV3 which will be around the size of a Kia Seltos for a smaller city electric SUV. SUV that would appeal to shoppers seeking a high-riding, practical design. In 2026, Kia intends to introduce the EV2, a compact electric vehicle that may cost less than $30,000. The EV3 SUV and the EV4 Saloon are two new fully electric ideas that the business unveiled at its inaugural EV day in South Korea. Additionally, it confirmed the specifications of the EV5, a future mid-size SUV. With the recent introduction of the EV9, which leads to an alluring electrified pack, there will be four new EVs on the road over the next two years. Imagine you were the director of the Marvel Universe movies. The first series of movies like Iron Man, Captain Marvel, and so on were really big hits. Now you're planning to release the next set of movies. Similarly, the EV series of Kia was a huge success, motivating the company to release more quality models. The CEO of Kia has revealed intentions to introduce a smaller EV2 to sit below the EV3 model. Furthermore, it can already be produced at Kia's Celina Slovakia factory, which also makes the Sportage and Keyed models. Kia stated the EV2 will go on sale in 2026 for less than $30,000, making it the cheapest model in its planned lineup. There was no mention of UK price, but a straight conversion would cost about £24,300. This was announced despite the fact that Kia had no concept car or picture to present to present on the day. 
Given that the EV4 is a mid-sized saloon and the new EV3 concept focuses on the small SUV market, it appears likely that the EV2 will be a smaller compact crossover or SUV. It is likely to be based on Kia's exclusive eGMP platform for electric vehicles. Additionally, its dimensions may resemble those of the current Kia, which is a well-liked and hotly competitive class among European consumers but it will sport the SUV's recognizable stylistic characteristics. The EV2 is expected to be imported into the US eventually, even if it appears that Europe will be the initial market for it. In the US, Kia's or its parent company Hyundai's least expensive model right now is the somewhat antiquated Kona Electric SE. The model can travel up to 258 miles at its maximum range. At $27,495, the small Chevrolet Bolt EV wins the title of the most reasonably priced US EV with a range of 259 miles. However, the latter is smaller and probably a more obvious competitor for the upcoming EV1. According to recent information, this EV2 will be more reasonably priced than the Bolt and Kona and will provide more interior room, better material quality and a longer electric range. According to Kia CEO Song Ho Sung, the cost increase compared to ICE equivalents and the lack of a widespread charging network continue to be the two key obstacles to EV adoption. Kia has joined forces with Ionity in Europe to install 7,000 new chargers by 2025 as part of its efforts to improve the charging network. In the US, it is a member of an alliance made up of six major OEMs that aim to install 30,000 chargers by 2030. Its future EV sales will be largely supported by this more affordable EV2, giving buyers who would not have wanted to upgrade to a larger electric SUV the option to go with a less expensive electric hatchback crossover. What would be the situation if a major company's CEOs started quitting after some chain of failures? Will we be able to see innovative products in that condition? Of course not. So we always recommend you to stay patient. We should keep in mind that great things will have to take on their own to form a base. Data from Kelly Blue Book for May 2023 indicates that the typical price of a new electric vehicle transaction was $55,000. That is almost $7,000 more costly than the same ICE purchase. The adoption of EVs will only quicken with the release of models that help drive that price down to 35 k or even under $30,000, solidifying Kia's position as a key player in the EV market. Kia is going through a significant transition as it launches a more comprehensive line of EVs, beginning in 2024 with the EV5. The EV5 is a significant departure for Kia since it is the first vehicle built on the eGMP platform to run at 40 to run at 400 volts instead of the 800 volt design found in the larger EV6 and EV9. It is also the first to use front wheel drive. The EV5 will be produced for the Australian market at a Chinese plant, a first for Kia Australia. Kia is realigning all of its factories for strategic output. The China factory will produce medium and large models for both domestic and export markets. The Korean facilities will continue to carry out a larger portion of the brand's heavy lifting which is referring itself as an EV global hub. The new India factory will produce small and affordable vehicles for emerging markets, and the Slovakian factory will continue to produce small and mid-sized vehicles for Europe. In order to support full lineup production throughout the Americas, Kia will also establish factories in the US and Mexico. By 2026, a million EVs will be sold by Kia, accounting for 25% of its total volume. The EV9 
is scheduled to debut in Australia before the end of 2023, and the EV5 is expected to follow some time in 2024. While the production versions of the EV4 and EV2 are anticipated to make their debut in 2025, the production versions of the EV3 is scheduled for introduction in 2024, but is unlikely to make it to Australia before 2025. The EV9, which will shortly be on sale, is the most expensive production Kia model ever manufactured, and is anticipated to start at a little under than $100,000 before on-road expenses. It is located at the other end of the price spectrum. What are your expectations for the Kia EV2? Will it rock up and top the EV market in 2024? We should wait and see. And that wraps up our in-depth look at the all-new $25,000 Kia EV2. A vehicle that's not just stepping into the electric battleground, but is aiming to redefine it. Before you dive into the comments, remember to hit that like button if you found our content informative and engaging. Your support is what fuels our passion and helps us bring you the latest and greatest automotive innovation. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notifications. Until next time.